Hey, hey, and welcome back to Paradigm. I figured out that in order to get this traffic cone, because that's how I'm going to, like, lure, or do, I don't know, I'm going to do something with the cone. I have no idea. But anyways, there was a traffic cone here, and I have to, to get it. So, you got to feed the dog, and he drinks. The only thing he eats is vodka. So, you got to pour vodka in there, but it's not strong enough. So, you got to get some pure ethanol, and you got to strengthen it up for him. I thought he was dead, but his tail is wagging, so. I think he's alive, but I really don't know. Let's check out some things around the shop first. Um, what's this? What Look nice at these. Asshole. He left me a note. <laughs> okay, nice house. Hello, proprietor of computers for sale. I'm looking for an individual named Paradigm. He's hideous. Oh, don't, don't call him ugly, man. Oh, he's pretty ugly, though. <laughs> You might know him. While knocking on your door, I accidentally slipped and broke through your door. <laughs> and I then accidentally searched everything inside. <laughs> My mobile is broken, so I'll come back to contact you. Sorry about the door. I tried to fix it, so I attached this clip art of a cool son to say sorry. Aqua, Dupagenetics henchman. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, I think that's... Yeah, I'm not pressing on that. That is too funny. The radio is friggin' hilarious. Alright, so we're gonna go back to the junkyard and see if the cone will be lured away by one of his followers. Alright, so I'm not really sure what we gotta do with it, but I'm gonna try making it fly. Apparently that's what you gotta do with it. Um... What if One I put it on this paper? Abuse the power of caution. Nah. I kind of figured that wouldn't happen. So, we gotta make the sucker fly somehow. Or what if we One put it on her head? Abuse the power of no. Hmm. This is gonna be a tough one. I find it. Some of the puzzles. One see, what if we put it? Abuse the power of caution. Okay, this is gonna be tough. Uh, Let's use. This would be the solution to get rid of, especially. Damn it! All right, so what if I try and put the cone on him? That would be a waste of a perfectly good cone. I think I could use it to distract him somehow. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure that out. It seems that I might need something else in my inventory. Mm -mm. I want to put it right there. That looks like the perfect place for it. Boop. Oh, that refrigerator has a face. But there's no way I could climb up there anyway. Maybe there's a way I can make it fly. Rocket science. I've always wondered <laughs> how it must feel for actual rocket scientists. You know? How many have broken down emotionally <laughs> from hearing that joke so many times at dinner parties? <laughs> How depressed they are to hear that joke. Alright, I think we've got a plan here. It's time to launch this rocket. Hopefully, it's gonna distract the cone. And I got a sharp spoon. I don't know what it's for, but um, I found it up at the, the drug dealer's mansion. Basically, you gotta go get a rocket, which I didn't notice before, at uh, Space Cadets, and then you put the cone on there. So... Let's see if we can uh, launch this puppy. Fire it into the atmosphere. How do we launch it, though? Is this a little mini Is launch there pad? Is something inherently wrong launching something that the con has psychologically personified into ultimate destruction? Then ripping the head off his wife to trick a drug dealer into thinking I murdered a police officer? It'll be Those fine. They probably would be right. Perfect. It doesn't seem to be working. Well, how do I light it? Oh, there we go. Boom. That was the most powerful launch on Earth. Okay, the cone is... This is going to be a real tragic story. That music, man. Oh my god! The cone! No! Not the cones! 
They're firing off into space. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, notice the cone already. <laughs> I feel so evil right now. It tumbled to, as the t as the cone tumbled towards us. It wondered, why do I exist? <laughs> I kind of figured he couldn't fly. You're just a fake superhero. Back inside the butt. Alright, now I can finally steal his wife's head. That sounds so wrong. Alright, let's uh, take this puppy. Right. Finally, I can take your head. What the hell? It's not coming off. The oh, of man. I need to get it off somehow. Oh. Maybe that's what I use this little fella for. Fine. What? My dreams are coming true. I get to sever a head with a serrated spoon. Because it's dull and it'll hurt more. A few hours later. Wow, that only took me eight hours to cut through with the Krush army spoon. I was estimating at least ten. Take that, Swiss army knife. <laughs> Oh man, this game, this game, I tell you. All right, so let's just combine that. My very Boop. own decapitated police hit. Time to bring it to the drug dealer. Time to fool this guy. He'll never notice the difference. He's got a cardboard cutout. As a guard, anyway. All right. What's going on now, mate? I got something for you. Uh, hello? Uh, I've got the, the head now. C can I, uh, can I come in now? Impressive. Stand back a bit and I'll open the gates. I didn't even show him the head. Why did I even bother going to get it? Are hey, you gonna open the gates? <laughs> can you let me in though? See that? <laughs> it's like the gate is talking. You read the key before, right? <laughs> Here. Uh, not that one. And I don't get the reference. Nights, 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 what? Nights. I really shouldn't be surprised. Meanwhile, Sir? at customer service. <laughs> Sir, I've been waiting here all day. Can you please see to us? It doesn't seem like you're doing anything. Hang on, I'm doing really secretary stuff. Ting, ting. <laughs> <laughs> secretary is best. Done. What do you need? I have a complaint. Complaint? Oh, wonderful. It's what I live for. Our son, our prodigy child that we bought on the 22nd of January 2016, is faulty. What do you mean, faulty? They aren't budget, no-name electronics that break, crushing your children's hopes and dreams on Christmas morning, they all say, why doesn't Santa love us, Mummy? Why did he give us broken presents? Should have just bought the official one, but no, you wanted to save a few bucks. He is- You cheapo! All right, calm down, miss. What seems to be the problem? He, he, he wants to become an artist jesus christ mom i'm not an artist i'm a two-dimensional oh god <laughs> can you see he's tearing our family apart faulty all right all right we've seen this before can you please sign these papers and if you don't mind little johnny stand on that little circle thing over there hey man i don't conform to your ideals Go slay some dragons, you inconsiderate pig! What if I told you that over there, on the circle there, is a gluten-free mocha papito latte? Really? <laughs> I know, this has been a so good. Sign of prodigy children. Again, I apologize. Just sign the waiver here, and we'll get you the replacement. 
That is, what in the name of God is that? That must be the drug dealer, I guess. And there's an octopus version of it, I guess. All right, mega bad, bro bad. Uh, I can't read that. All right, what's up, man? Give me these drugs, yo. I don't have all day. Just give me the drugs. Give me that sweet white powder, yo. Hello, drug silly man. Hello. Insert name here. Refer to their name if you can. It allows you to connect on a more friendly, personal level. What? Oh, I'm just trying out some techniques I read in an audiobook. I think you should lay off the audiobooks, man. Can I buy some space? Can yeah. I buy some space dust now? I think I've gone through enough. Well, if you have a thousand cruise marks, I can give you the token for the vending machine over there. Oh, I'll eat my God. ass. I don't have the cash for that. Also, token? Super fun, cool, drug enthusiast drug tokens. The official currency for the vending machine. No space dust for you. But tough biddies. Damn you. All right, what can we do? I'm sure we can come to an understanding. I could... I could love you. I'm sure <laughs> we can come to an... We could be friends. What does that wink mean? I it means know. we can come to an understanding. I saw it in a movie once. Thought it might work. Nope. All right. What else can we do? Is there like, could I like wash your Is dishes there or something? Uh, anything else I can do? I can bake a mean cupcake that will blow your mind. All right. No one ever buys from me anyway, so I'll play you for it. Yeah. Sweet. If you can beat my game's high score, I'll give you a super fun, cool drug enthusiast drug token. Uh, what game is that? Prepare your body. It's the most brutal, unforgiving game ever developed. Oh god. An underground classic, sought oh, by man. collectors everywhere. Oh no. Behold. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. It's not working. Hold on. Do you have like a God big thing to, to blow on it? Ruining my finely crafted atmosphere. I'm never buying floor stock again. Just take I it out and blow it. Blow. Works every time. Told ya. <laughs> Who's blowing on it? Wait, what? what? I, I thought it was going to be on the big screen. Try it for yourself. Grab that controller over there. Oh, I have one of these. Oh, there's there's one of these at my shop um, over in town or whatever. All right, let's kick this high score's ass. Oh, dude, gross. This controller is all sticky and only leads to one side. I can't play with this. That's what Damn. she said. Isn't it she said? Ha! <laughs> yeah, and my online comedian degree is a scam. <laughs> I think it is. get full-fledged degrees in three days, and only at the price of full control of my life insurance. Bargain. Next week is a Seamfield Masterclass. Anyway, you're stuck with the <laughs> controller. Deal with it. Oh man, I can't deal with this. I need another controller. Oh man! All right, all right. Let's get let's get the hell out of here. Let's go just go get that controller for a minute, and we'll be right back after these messages. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Okay. Um. Yeah. Right over here, Paradigm Shop. There's one sitting right there. I guess it could be handy. Yeah, damn right it could be handy. Now let's get the hell out of here. Um. Right there. Yeah. Back to the drug dealer, because I want some of them good, sweet, amazing drugs, bruh. Drugs. Drugs. Bumps. Okay, let's do this. Let's plug it in. Um, plug it in. Plug it in. Man, guess only controllers are such bullshit. Hey, drug dealer. There's your self-respect on the roof. What? Let's play Go the ball. Thing. It's written up there. Okay. 
All right, let's do this. Oh wait, do I actually gotta play the game? Like seriously? That's so cool. Every random Street Fighter ever. Boosting thugs. A badass huge dude. Or that crazy looking girl that probably kicks ass. She's got some super cute boots on. Obviously. I'm gonna play duder. Cause he's a dude. And I'm a dude. I like being a dude. Yeah boy. Time to bust some heads with some positive thinking. Welcome to Boosting Thugs. Thanks, man. Press the letter C to jump. I think I can do that, man. If I can find it. Yes. Press the letter X to punch. Nice. Dope, dude. <laughs> Please don't uh, help you at all in this game. All right, cool. Thanks. I didn't get a chance to read that. It's going too fast. Your mission is to boost Thug's self-esteem with compliments. Go practice on that sandwich over there. <laughs> Press the letter B to boost. So that's all I need or what? Yo, sandwich dude. Looking delicious. It says salami. I'm impressed. You would be at least 20 bucks at the local dilly. <laughs> Good job, man. Lettuce. So nutritious. Good job, bro. All right, that's me practicing. So I'm gonna go over here and we're gonna boost this sandwich self-esteem better than, than I don't know, but it's gonna be good, man. It's not working. What if I just punch him? That's, that's not working either. Oh yeah, oh, okay, all right, so it is still point and click. Um, this one. Cheers, dude! Thug boosted. <laughs> I can't believe he's a thug, man. Yeah, sandwich thug. I'll slap you with my lettuce. I'll tase you with my tomatoes. All right, so I gotta boost his self-esteem. Give me all your mana, tubular. All right, so let's do the old B. Um, this one. <laughs> Whoa, is that magic? You could probably have your own TV show or something, damn it. Thanks, bro. I think I could need I need to reevaluate this whole street the career thing. Well that was easy. That's how we should fight crime in real life. Boost their self-esteem. That's all they need, old man. Just a little bit of love. What's this? Can I take this? Alright, let's get out of here. Let's keep on going. I wanna go in the mouse club over there. Okay, don't know if I'm gonna be able to boost the devil's self-esteem. Hey kid, wanna boost some self-esteem? Yeah. Yeah, I guess I would, but I never thought of it that way. Yeah, Liz, let's do it. Hail Zaydan! Okay. Can I can I boost the self-esteem? Surprise you, Tweed. Give me all your lo-fi recording equipment. Oh sorry. Hey beta. Hey Astron. Okay. Um, something really good. Nice makeup. You could probably make a solid career out of that. Or at least a semi-successful internet show. I saw the lightning thing. That was cool. Being able to control elements would look awesome on a resume. That one. <laughs> Please be boosted. Please be boosted. Yeah. Right next to experience. Struggling black metal musician. No. This one. Sweet guitar, dude. I bet you could start one of those black metal bands. Have a small, awesome... That's why I'm doing street crime in the first place. Okay, um... Nice makeup, dude. You could go on YouTube! Uh, well, uh, I never considered that. Uh, it's always been a dream of mine. It's been a vile career option. Well then, thanks, Duder. Back to the depths of hell to get my makeup supplies. <laughs> Peace, dude. <laughs> Satan's face! What is going on? Why am I a shark? I don't know, did, did I like beat his high score or whatever? Oh yes. I boosted the hell out of those thugs. Yeah, That's my line. pretty well.
Only 34,123 levels to go. What? Really? I don't have time I don't think. This. I don't think I'm going to do that. Do. I don't believe you. Uh, true. Still. Still, no space dust. Damn it. I'm out this. So... I think I can help you be boosting thugs. Where, where, who, said, who said that? Oh, it's, it's the octopus. Yeah. Legends say that there is a mythical code to beat any Mega Bro game. Like a Konami code? For legal reasons, no. Well, how can I get it? It's said to be lost to time and space. Forever. Yeah, sick. That's great help. Let me finish, Jesus! There are whisperings <laughs> that it can be found lost in electromagnetic waves. Oh, it's on the radio! I think. Nice, okay. Um... Just in case. Uh, can I have a better hint? That's all I can say. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's on the radio. Thank you. Why are you? I just really hate the drug dealer, to be honest. I'll be back soon. What if I could just break into this and get the space dust that way? I mean, that would be way more simple. What is the war pipe? What does it do? Hey, a war pipe. I've always wondered what it's like inside. It's very red dark and I think I can see my soul I I think I see it I'm going I'm going to hell man this is the end oh Jesus <laughs> I don't want to know anymore no me neither let's get out of here that was really scary all right so let's go back to my shop real quick and I'm betting I'm betting. I'm. I'm not just betting. I know that it's gonna be on the radio, cause you know, electromagnetic, uh, magnetic waves. That just makes sense. But I don't know how long I can listen to this radio because it's. It just makes me laugh. Is he still alive? Totally not tipsy, Igorsky. Yeah, he doesn't look tipsy at all. He looks barely alive. <laughs> okay, let's um, let's use it. Let's check out what's on the radio. Whoa, 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 welcome! This is Advertisement Radio, where we play advertisements all day, every day! From around the world! From around the world! A world where you spend every last cent of your savings, and then your wife leaves you! Taking your dog! Taking your favorite hat! Taking your hemorrhoid donut cushion! Eventually leaving you to heat <laughs> a can of beans with your butane lighter! And then you're left staring at your blank wall because your TV was taken too! Haha, <laughs> enough about me! Let's get into the advertisement! Hey there, Wait, is Billy. that it? Do you like Free BYK. Games? Yeah! Do you like gross amounts of virtual violence? Yeah! Yeah! Do you like doing taxis? What? I'm 11 years old, mister. Well, then you'll love our new game from Mega Bro. The there we go. brought you such hits as Boosting Thug, Zeldario Zany Man X Zone, Introducing Tax Evasion, the game. the game! Play as multi-dimensional company with fun gameplay such as Threaten or bribe government officials Choose which offshore countries to put your profits Recruit a dream team of lawyers Find and silence whistleblowers Whoa, cool! Available March 4th, 2025 Oh, what? It doesn't oh, no. tell me the code! Grandma is gone! What do we tell Billy? Don't tell Billy a thing Gran insurance Billy, is here. Billy can suck it. We'll send a clone replacement to Grandma within one business day. She'll be baking cookies straight out the stasis box in no time. Just remember to clean the stasis liquid or uncontrollable bloodlust may occur. We'll guarantee a cookie-cooking, sweater-knitting slave for years to come. Available at clonegrandma.com. Thanks, Grandma Insurance. What would we have done without you? Gene Pierce's This Decade's Modern Musical Genius is about oh my to God. his new, most anticipated album. I feel so enlightened. Our love is drifting apart. Here's a small sample. Ah! 
Man, these are actually pretty good. Yeah, he's a weird dude, that's for sure. Anyways, I'm gonna try this code. Three B Y K. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. That's pretty annoying. All right, so I'm gonna try that code. Three B Y K on um, the game, up wherever the hell that is. Oh yeah, up at the drug dealer guy's place. That weird dude. They're all weird dudes. Every single person in this entire place is a weird dude. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I know the codes. I'm the big man. I know everything. Give me the space dust. But how do you enter the code anyway? All right, let's use this sucker. Hmm. Inputs. What if I just did the Konami code, just cuz? Just to see if it would work. But there's no A or, or anything. 3BYK, so no, that wouldn't work. There are no letters, I mean, uh, there are letters, but there are no... So we got a B, a Z, an X. Hmm. Input password using Z, okay. And X. Or press B to exit. Okay, so it's gotta be a combination of Z's and X's. You can't press B or you're done. All right, all right, all right. So what if it's up on here on the TV some way? Let's, let's just take a little journey around here. Where, where could the password, isn't that the space dust right there? Like, that looks like space is dust space to me. Dust? Oh, it's just piles and piles of little papers with dead jokes on them. One says, I am a dad. I am responsible for my children and being witty. This is too much stress and responsibility for me to handle. I'm not sure whoever wrote these understands how jokes work. I bet you he wrote them all. Man, I wish that was the pile of space dust. Okay, so... What if, where the heck am I gonna find that? There wasn't any code on the radio in B's, I mean, uh, in X's and Z's. All right, so I, I just thought of something. I think, I think I figured out the code. It says, on the radio advertisement, it says Zeldario Zone, I mean, I think X and Z. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Take that. I boosted the hell of those thugs. Uh, yes. I, bo I beat the whole game and it only took me like five minutes, man. You gotta Wait, give me the drugs now, hell? mate. You totally cheated. Some nah, man. Code nah. Bullshit. I beat the Come whole on, thing. Man. A deal is a deal. Oh, God damn it. Here, my last super drug enthusiast token. By the way, some big guy was looking for you. Super Wait. nice. Apparently wanted to dissect you for some reason or another. You're only telling me this now. What? To be honest, I'm just super stressed about how I'm going to pay the bank back for all those high interest loans for all this gear. Why would someone want to dissect little old me? I don't want to be dissected. I'm too young to be dissected. No. All right, here you go, man. Here's the token. Take it. Free Take it now. I'm yeah. One space dust, please. That was an insane amount of work for this tiny little thing. Wait, there's no, there it is. Karasaki space dust. Enjoy your space dust. Finally. Thanks, dude. Time to get that floppy disk and, uh, and not, you know, die Blow a horrible up. death. I wonder where that space dust came from. All right. Oh no, is he dead? I think he's dead. Oh no, this is. Oh man. No. No. Oh god. Be dead. Dude, don't be dead. You have to pass out now. Wait a second. No. I could just take it off him. Sitting on the box of these the whole time. You douchebag. It's good to see you still have motor functions, judging by the twitch of your leg. 
Now let's go save Kush from inevitable destruction. And nice. For a little bit longer. So I can make some fat beatsies. Okay, so let's get the let's get the stuff, man. Wait. Yeah, okay. Um Talk to him, I guess. Observatory. No, I want I want him, man. Oh, the box is right there. Okay, cool. I I didn't see that for some reason because I guess I'm blind. All right, pick it up. If I get back, and it turns out John just wanted me out of the house to hook up with some biddies, I swear to DJ Jesus, I will make Internet Explorer the default web browser and wave a magnet over his hard drive. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what is that? No. Doug, what no. did they do to you? Poor Bill. Dougie. Why did they do Come this? Close. This is horrible. Last bit. No, Drop that fat beatsy man. Your energy. We need to get you to a hospital. Better than I've always considered you my best friend. Even though we they just met like five was. minutes ago. <laughs> no! <laughs> so cheesy. I will avenge you. <laughs> oh man, you asked is, is he serious? You expect your own death to avoid paying rent? Maybe. What a douche. That's the last time I have a heartfelt moment for you. Oh, so I've actually known him for a long time and he pays rent to sit out here and sell fat beasties? <laughs> All right. Get out of my way. I've got somewhere to be so the whole of Krush doesn't explode. Uh, what are you doing? Okay, well, maybe think about it over that way so I can, you know, get in my house. Yeah, I don't care about some person and his socks. Specifically, what you're doing here? Cool, cool, but uh, there are no defunct prodigy childs around here. I'm not a prodigy child. I'm just a normal man with giant tumors on my face. You're a glorified just doing boy. my thing. You don't have any teeth. <laughs> Gonna be a baller next week. He's got a little Astro Boy on his shoulder. That's cool. Um, can I can I just go inside, please? Can you? Nothing at all. Um, so what if I gave you a water purifier? Look, a three-headed monkey. Yee! A three-headed monkey. Oh man, that didn't work. What? What if I... <laughs> um, don't you have any hopes and dreams you want to fulfill? I'd write you a song. What if I asked you this? Can you let me through? <laughs> what if I ask you like this? Can you let me through? If <laughs> okay, um, what if I write you a song, man? Damn, ah, uh, there's not many options left. I don't want to service him. Um, don't you have any hopes and dreams you want to fulfill? Why don't you? What if I told you? Time to put boosting thugs to good use. It feels like I'm on a date with water. Okay, so let's boost Ready. him up, baby. Let's do this. Boost. Maximum boost. <laughs>
Boosting I bet you contain so much fluoride, you're like a magical shield for my teeth. You have the most majestic bop I've ever seen. Wow. So many hot models would love you. You're like zero calories hot. That's gotta work, man. He'll love that. Wow. Think so? Models? He's dropping some fat beatsies. I love it. I didn't even think that possibility. Thanks, man. You're looking pretty good today. He's even helping. I guess he's paying his rent after all. A hundred percent. You you get those dreams. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, dude. <laughs> okay. I'll just I'll just be on my way then. <laughs> just teleport him into the offices. Come on, dude. You know, Mr. Yorpodoskvasak. Beam me up, Scotty. Under aggressive management. Did you know? Without paradigm, we can't fix the others. And without fixing the others, Dupa genetics goes into the red. When we go into the red, Mr. Yorpodoskvasaki doesn't get his paycheck. Then Mr. Yorpodoskvasaki can't pay for his subscription to Kawaii Cats Online. Quagetole. Oh, dude. Don't bring Hawaii cats into this. There I want no a, I want a subscription of that. Yay! Yeah. This machine is janky as hell. Bob from accounting is still inside out from the last test. He had a body fellow who loved him very much. Now not so much. Tell is it a waifu? Into the offices. But uh, we don't have that kind of technology, the other sir. Faulty prodigy children are there. I don't want a revolution on my hands. Just do what I Oh, there's I a bonsai say. tree up there. Right. Oh. Jesus, dude. Good vibes. Are you sure that's how it works? Excuse me. I think I know a little bit more about matter decompilers than you. I'm a scientist here. <laughs> Just throw coffee on it. Whoa. My controller. I think it's gonna explode. Nice. Oh, now I can yes. finally use the floppy. So goddamn pumped. Yeah. It's finally, time to make some fat beats, play some epic music. Oh, Davo. I was looking forward to a third apocalypse. Maybe some mutated mold could replace you. I imagine it would have far more personality. Mold the adventure game. Now that dream is taken away. <laughs> I'm going to ignore that you said that, and let's boot up this bed. All right, let's boot the sucker up. KK, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. You're annoying, you're annoying me, you're annoying me. I don't really feel like it. Come on, mate, this happens every time. Can't really force inspiration, man. I guess I might as well browse endlessly and discover fetishes I never realized I had. Oh no. What the hell is that? What is going on? What the hell? I'm turning into a basketball. Man, Time to leap. Really weird. Of my browser history. <laughs> this is kind of like. Oh my god. It's kind of like that movie, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. I knew it was too good to be true. I should have caught on when they asked me for my credit card number. Yeah, you're really screwed up, man. When they turn into yarn. That's my favorite part of the entire movie. If you've never watched that, you're missing out. You've got to watch it. Act two. Oh god, where am I? You're in space. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna implode. I'm gonna implode. Welcome to the multiverse. Here, you are one with each of your multidimensional. Yeah, this is exactly like Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Cool, cool. Ow, it hurts. He looks so quiet now. It's not so bad the second time. Who are you? Is there? I actually kind of like it now. <laughs> this multiverse? Because if there is, I am going to have to speak to him. I. Uh, I've got some words I, to say. I guess I'm technically the manager. 
I gotta write a letter. My spiel. I'm going to start again. I, and it's not gonna be fun. Seeing keeper of the multiverse. Sweet. My purpose is to tell you. Tell me what? Just shut up for a second. You, you are the chosen one. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Really? Do I get some powers? I don't need much. Self-esteem would be pretty great if you have any of that left. Are you sure? Last time I was told I need chosen I wanted my credit card number. Serious? I always thought I had the jawline for it. <laughs> what? Really? Do I get any powers? I don't need much. Self-esteem would be pretty great if you have any of that left. No. <laughs> <laughs> None of us what have any of that. You was what us multiverse keepers call in the biz Ruslan Jimmies. <laughs> People sometimes breach the multiverse from messing around with teleportation. We just like to mess with people's heads. Cause we're bored. You aren't the chosen one. You do have a semi-important part, though. The actual chosen one is a way cooler, 25 to 35 year old black-haired male with a gruff voice. Anyway, so your time is up. You. Peace. Do you have Wait, black hair? Can I ask you something else before I go? Uh, yeah, I, I guess. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I know this one. It's 42. Yeah, this one. Internal Perfect. Monologues. The answer is... Yes? <laughs> Hit me with it. No, it's been taken away. No, it's too soon. <laughs> Man, I love this job. That shit never gets old. <laughs> I gotta agree, that wouldn't get old for me either. Why is it like a cartoon now? This is cool. Damn it. I was this close to knowing the answer to life's greatest question. Welcome to my dungeon. You are now my prisoner for eternity. Forever tormented by the thing that once gave you refreshment. Now only providing you with never-ending pain! What are you gonna do to my insides? Ugh, deja vu. Oh well then, almighty tormentor. Speaking of refreshing beverages, my throat is quite parched, as I presumably was split into a million pieces and transported through time and space. Can I trouble you for one? Silence! My refreshing days are over! <laughs> Bow down to the eternal sound of the forever restarting refrigerator motor. May oh, it be God. a reminder of your sins. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna... Buying sounds. Yeah, just wait till you're just about to fall asleep. And this bad boy kicks in. You're gonna be so irritated. I will be <laughs> sure to heed that warning, water cooler of doom. I'm glad you're starting to show some respect. If you're lucky. I'll let you lick my nipple nozzles. Do you really nipple nozzles? Well, if you can think of a better name for them, I'm all ears. Tips? Ugh. The hell? I like there. nipple nozzles better. Sick. I got You're disgusting. Prison room thing. Alrighty. Well, I think we're gonna end it there. That was quite the. This is quite the game, man. It's quite the ride. It is so funny. If you haven't played it i think you should pick it up because it is you're, you're just gonna have endless laughs throughout the entire thing so uh, it's kind of corny humor yeah but i don't know it just makes me laugh so hard <laughs> it's like a don't like try not to laugh challenge for me anyway i'll see you on the next one hey, adios